Dementia has affected my family in a really big way. My mum was diagnosed with Alzheimer's. I suppose in her early 60s, it was a long period before we actually got a formal diagnosis for her and that's part of what makes this so frustrating. You know, in the early days we didn't really know what was wrong with her. Uh, I think a lot of people, including my family, thought that maybe it was some kind of anxiety or depression. Um, but she declined quite rapidly after that and it was really quite heartbreaking to, to experience, to go through and, and we lost her a few months ago. Part of what makes it so hard, obviously, is watching someone go through that, but also watching me and my dad. He's worked so hard his whole life to, to enjoy his retirement with, with his wife, and that's just not the way his life turned out. He became a, a full-time carer for her. You know, he's had a whole host of health issues of his own, heart problems and stuff related to stress, so um, all of this kind of compounded in a massive way. But I have a sister as well, and we've kind of rallied together throughout this to try and um, support him and I suppose make things easier for her. Well, being a dementia friend for me is hugely important because I really think we need to educate people on how likely this is to affect them in some way. We don't want to think that it's going to happen to us or that someone we love is going to be affected by dementia, but it's incredibly likely that it will. It robs so many people of that later part of their lives and that's the time when you really want to be enjoying retirement and, and spending time with your loved ones. For me it was such a horrible thing for our family to go through that I think channeling all of that grief and, and heartbreak I suppose into something positive is, is the best way to deal with it.